is I'm going to basically... Where'd that piece of birch go? It could be on the counter. Of course it did. What a piece of shit. Okay, I do have one sign, but I'm going to need more anyway, so... There you go, now I have four signs. Hooray signs. So what we can do with these... Let's place them on the ends here. Kind of like what I do with my benches, but, uh... Hmm. This would look better with stairs. I, I always change my mind after I do stuff. You'll very quickly realize this. So, not that the bench design can't work, but I think it works better when you have the signs as backing for it. Like, kind of like how I did outside. So if I don't have a backing, I kind of have to use stairs. It's... Yeah, because that looks all that much better. Stairs. And the second they go to 1.4, I can put a stair in that corner and it'll meld to it properly. So I won't have to worry about that stupidity. There you go, you got yourself a corner seat. Looks pretty cool, doesn't it? That's what I thought. So, the corner seats. Also need a table. I'm pretty sure I know how I'm going to do a table here. If we just throw that there. Why not? Works. Hmm. Probably work for exploring, actually. Or work better. Which I can make happen. With the power of physics. All of a sudden, it's a floating table. Look at that. Witchcraft and wizardry. Harry Potter, get on my level. If I can get, like, uh... Two, three, four, six more signs. Which means like this, and that pressure plate is gonna get very annoying. Breaking my brain. Oh boy. And. There is your table. Now it's completely floating, but uh, legit. Floating table, people. Get on my level. So, with the floating table installed, you can also have. I'm trying to figure out another way to get rid of these last two birch things, so. Because I kind of have room for a seat. Too close to the stairs, never mind. I could do it in the corner. Yeah, corner seat would work. Could still have two of these as well. And there you go. Now, actually. Hmm. What kind of a bar am I going to create? Throw a pool there, why not? Gives it that much extra character. Doesn't it? It kind of does, you know? It just looks a little bit better with that there. I don't know. Kind of does. Can't really argue against it. It's all based on personal taste. And before I forget, throw a sign here, and it turned night day in it. Oh god. I know this place is fairly well lit, but I know it's not well lit enough to prevent creeper spawnage. So sleep right away. Even though they probably already spawned. Oh boy. Now I'm worried about creepers. 
Which is fantastic, to be completely honest. Because now I'm going to be on my guard for creepers the entire time. Make sure you don't see me through the windows and got to start uh, placing windows and doors. Because I don't want this shit to go for naught, because I will just pray and roll it back if they start blowing stuff up in here. Because that would be terrible. That would be a waste of time. And there you go. Two doors. Urgent. I still need to do. <sighs> to the bomb shelter we go. We'll be able to lure out all the creepers on my way. If I'm lucky. So. What? I have. Oh, yeah, I do. That's right, I'm smart. I stored some in there. Who does forget how smart I am? A path to nowhere in particular. Uh, I'd make it go to your side there, but no one sees there's a lake there, and I'd rather leave the lake. I don't know, the lake's like a nice touch. I'd rather not destroy that. Just throw those onto the ice. And we grab our doors now. Place one here, and we place the other one next door. Now, if there are any creepers outside, they cannot get in. If there's any creepers on the roof, however, which... Okay, good. Because I didn't place any lights up here, and that would have been terrible. Because then there's no way I could I could have done anything. Okay, so... Just go back down to our bar, make sure... Looking good. Yeah, plenty of space. Uh, kind of a main walking path here. So, you know, I kind of left a little bit of space there. I could honestly put chairs next to these, but, uh... Hmm. It'd be kind of hard to, because the sign thing, but... Ah. Uh, I'm wondering. Maybe I should... I didn't, didn't have an extra. Doesn't matter. We'll do it. Now leave me with five extra stairs, but that's okay. Cause three of them are probably gonna go in the bedrooms up, upstairs anyway. So we're gonna do this. I'm gonna go back to our crafting table. We just need three signs, which that's a check easy enough to craft. There you go. Oh boy. It's always something. So you do that. Now it's like you can get off the table from this end here. You get the point. Pretty cool. I like this bar. Tavern thing. Hooray. Could also throw like a fireplace or something under there, but forget it. Looks pretty snazzy. I like it. That's pretty much all that matters. So with that done, and start with the interior walls. Might as well. Nothing else to do really. Basically, it's like the last thing that needs to be done is just the upstairs bedrooms. Which I will need beds, but, uh... I should probably grab those now without I think about it, but... Oh well. Do it later. And I also need food. Okay, we've got the food. Actually... I don't even have rooms in my inventory for beds right now. Huh. Well, I need to make more doors anyway, so. Interior walls first, because that's just how cool I am. It's the way I roll. And we will basically just... Uh, just go around the perimeter like this. 
build it up that way. What? I was sure I placed that one in the right spot. This so iron completely stoned out of my mind, or... Which I mean smoke ma Whatever it is that gets stoned. For whatever reason, I almost said meth, which... Pretty sure it's marijuana. Pretty sure. Could be wrong. I'm not a drug expert, clearly. Clearly not. Don't take drug advice from me. <laughs> uh, even though I should know this shit, I clearly don't. Oh, uh, boy. I should know this stuff, too. For reasons that you guys are probably not aware of. And that you should probably never be aware of. I'm a psychology student. There you go. Psychology students should know stuff about drugs and how they affect the mind. And yet, somehow I managed to completely just fuck everything up. Hooray for being in incompetent. Oh, boy. Yay, high CPU usage. Better be high. I hope this game is actually using some of my CPU. Actually, it could be there's, all, there's also a memory leak, which means that my game will be crashing again sometime soon. Hooray! I forgot to put a block over this. Hooray! Okay, put a block over that one, yes. Good, that's all I wanted to know. Now I can jump back up through there. Shouldn't need a rise. I'll see if I put a crafting table in each room. For now, I just want to focus on the doors. And that should be good. If I can ever forget, just, just go. Go and do stuff. Throw that one there. Throw that one there. And as usual, throw this one there. Okay, there's my wood, and here's me riding over to my sheep pen to grab some wool. Because I'm pretty sure I got enough wool to make at least three beds. I got plenty of wool, but just because I'm going to go steer some more sheep. They're here, and they're not going anywhere, so... Grab their wool. All their wool. Look, okay, I've got enough for three beds. And I have enough for five more if I ever need five more. So now I need to basically... See. Do that. I should probably make two sticks first. There you go. Or four. You know what I mean. There you go, now I have room for free beds. It's amazing, isn't it? Now here's the beauty of this, is that I can actually place these beds and just sleep in this damn building. It'll be that much better than having to run all the way back every time it turns night. And we just throw these torches here for light in the hallway. As for the bedrooms. I think should be a light over each window. And there should also be a light near the door. Just personal opinion once again. Which just still needs to be finished. I'll finish that later. The reason I'm holding out on finishing it is because I need a way to get onto the roof to finish the roof. Which will eventually happen. So while I have these beds on me, I'm just going to start placing them where I think they should go. Which should be right by the window, in my opinion. For each room. Each room gets a bed by a window. And final room. Might as well just leave these doors open, because cool like that. There you go. I do have a crafting table on me too, so I can probably start with the 
process now of making a couple more. And it's probably nighttime, isn't it? Oh, not quite. So I guess that means we can just place these crafting tables wherever. Chrome by the door. Can I sleep now? Yes, I can. And my fault filter was sagging down there. Sorry about that. There, let me just adjust this real quick. Okay, I think that's good. Oh, boy. Pop filter problems, as usual. Not nearly as bad as I used to get, but uh, they're still pretty annoying when the problems come up. Let's see, I think I should have... If anything, I should have a table. 